and welcome back to the Dark Mod. William Steele won the North. I'm assuming we're in the North. Um, I'm also having trouble keeping track of who, who's who, which is normal for me, but not very convenient here. This wing is closed because of fire damage. If you have business in these rooms, seat Lieutenant Trumbull. If you lost items in the fire, you'll have to replace them yourselves. If you're looking for someone to be mad at, you'll find Sergeant Jacobs buried in the North Braden Boneyard. Falling asleep on duty while smoking, put him there. Oh my. So I guess I can't go in there. So Lieutenant Trumbull, oh boy. Lieutenant Trumbull, I hope he doesn't see me, would have access to that? I couldn't even, I couldn't even get in there. Oh, fuck me. Fuck me? If there's any trouble tonight, I'll be ready. Key on you, Mr. Trump. I don't want too many shadows. Yeah, you can sleep in your own room, dude. Now I'll look. Yeah, I'm definitely taking. I'll wait. We good now? Oh, definitely taking Lieutenant Trumbull out. I doubt anybody would come in here, but let's put that out just in case. Yeah, he doesn't have anything on him. All right, let me get you closer to this side just in case. Well, when I came in, I saw this. It was very odd, but there's nothing probable. I'm wondering if there are some things that can't be probable until I figure out what to do with them. You know, kind of like an adventure game. Ooh, fancy. Ah, guest rooms. Here we go. Teaching the guard Welton to read is taking longer than planned. Yesterday he revealed he's been tearing pages from the church history in the nave, trying to read them in his free times. The fool! Does he not know that the Count will have his hide for desecrating that manuscript? Walton took sick this morning and might not have long to live. I found one of the pages. Need to find the rest and restore the book before the Count finds out. Now the, the Count already knows. Or, yeah, I think it was the Count. Some Somebody already knows. Whitcomb. Lady Isabella arrives this afternoon. See the blue room upstairs is made ready for her and put her, her maid anywhere. Maid Isabella has had death threats lately, so she's bringing two personal guards. Keep a sharp eye. As house manager, I will have your head, should anything untoward happen. And have, your, have you found Lady Carrington's amulet yet? She claims that she lost it in the library. Step to it, man, or you'll be buying her a new one, Harkov. Yeah, for some reason last time I was thinking that Harkov was the frickin' um, priest. He's not. The fire. 112 years after its construction, Braden Church burned. None present at the time knew how the fire started. Some said Father Grimoire's ghost, unhappy with the direction of the Brotherhood at the turn of the new century, decided to punish it. Only the chapel and the catacombs were spared. All else redoomed reduced to scarred stone walls. The brothers, faced with the massive task of rebuilding and a hostile political climate, decided to dissolve the order. What remained of Braden Church was left to Grimoire's ghost, and the brothers interned in the catacombs. It is rumored that the church treasure was left behind, the brothers afraid of incurring the wrath of the dead should they remove it. Spooky. Um, is this part of the text we need to restore? Can we restore it? Whitcomb. Be sure to have the maids keep the floors and ceilings on the first and second floors clean. Dirt can harbor spiders and general filth. Trumbull's rooms are off limits and I don't care about the barracks. 
The staff can clean the cellars if they feel the need, as long as they do it on their own free time. Mary is the only maid I trust to clean my rooms. When she's fit again, please see that she attends to them. Harkoff. So I think Harkoff definitely had a thing for Mary, and that's why he ordered that the um, innkeeper's son be killed, unfortunately. So you can see why, why the head of the guard wants out and wants to take his daughter, secret daughter, with him. Hmm, odd, why would they... Oh wait, this is the upper health, health's room. Not health's, but health's. A broom! Calcove. Alcove, not Cal... Where did I get that from? Ah, an actual bathroom. Ah, the straw feels good against my padded boots. Or are they tap shoes? One of the two. How'd I close that door? Alright, these go down to the cellar, right? Yes. Okay, so this is where this comes up. Good to know. Ah, here's the entrance. I don't know if going out here will serve any purpose. But... Shall we? No, I think he just has cards there. He's not even playing solitaire. He's gonna have some boring nights. All right, we're actually almost done on this floor. Huzzah! That was an un unnecessary huzzah, wasn't it? Completely unearned. Yeah, I agree. Completely unearned. Ooh, books. So I'm wondering if there's a couple more pages. Oh, that's bright. Um, hidden somewhere. Because just because I don't have an optional objective right now doesn't mean that it's invisible. I've actually had those before. That wing cut off. And now on the top slash third slash second. Or, no, fourth floor. No, second. For some reason, I got confused by the differences between American and, Euro oh boy, European. Oh, this is creepy. European naming structure. Oh, dear God. I'm still going to get smote for this. But I'm leaving town and I need all the money I can get. Alright, if I take the candles off, they can't relight them. At least I don't think they can. They can't pick them back up and replace them, can they? Ah, hey, we found the skull. Yeah! Oh, Well, shit. He seems very confused. Also, why didn't that knock him out? Okay. I am confused. That is so creepy. At least I can't pick up the doll. There we go. All right. Seems good. Well, we're up here. Where's he coming from?
There he is. Make sure you close the door now. Oh, there he goes. I don't know why that didn't work before. Also, I have no idea where I'm going to dump this guy yet. I can't do it here because it's very well mean. Ah, okay. So I can go... That was odd. At least I can go down here. I wonder if there's anything secret up there. I do not know. Seems like I can easily get up to the attic at the very least, which is good. I still... Let's uncover that so I remember that it's there. Because remember, I'm very dumb, if nothing else. Hmm. Why is it when I see rooftops like that, I just want to climb up on top of them? I have no reason to, but Thieves Highway and all that. I swore I just heard something. Hello? Um, I don't know if I should take the skull yet. Church history. The skull of Father Grimoire. I think I might leave it there for now. Okay, Braden Church, a history. The early period. The Lord Builder visited Brother Grimoire in a dream and bade him to build a worthy church in the hills outside the town of Braden. Brother Grimoire gathered to him fifty devout brothers, carpenters, and masons, and over a period of five years did build the church based on a plan given him by the Lord Builder. When the church was finished, the brethren chose Brother Grimoire to lead it. He began a program of education and community service, spreading the word of the Builder far beyond the church's walls and Braden's borders. And as thy words are heard by unfortunate souls, will those souls rise up and build wondrous things. And then... I think we already picked up one, which is the fire, which might be the end of the ones that are torn out. But yeah, one of the guards tore some pages down. The remains of his flock, to this day, locals contain to continue to talk about terrible moans and screams coming from the site. They believe this is the father this is Father Grimoire's way of keeping looters out. But during my time at the ruins of Braden Church, I neither heard nor saw any evidence of Father Grimoire's ghost. Respectfully submitted, Brother S. Gallenhall, Bridgeport Church. Um Yeah, they decommissioned it because they didn't have enough funds after there was a horrendous I uh can I just open this? I can pick it open. Okay, I'm willing to do that. I, do that. Thank you. For It's a shiny skull. Not a golden skull, but a shiny skull. I wonder how, how long I had to grind to get a shiny skull to appear. And a uh, question. What's super effective against it? The outer door is to be locked and barred from dusk till dawn. And yet it isn't. What do you mean this down here? Hmm. They're trying to keep me in. I don't like this. I can see why I came in through the basement and a secret entrance. Alright, I need to get up into the rafters at some point. But it looks like I may be able to just climb over right there. It's a book. This will go down there and up. Dear Lord. All right. Well, we'll come back to the chapel later. Because we have other things that we can explore, Mafi. 
It seems like most doors I can pick. It was even even the um even the head guard's um, room door I was able to pick, even though there was a key for it. So hopefully the fact that I can't pick up that one key isn't gonna screw me because I'll just be able to Hello? I'll just be able to pick the lock. Hawkoff's chambers. Is this wait a minute? This is Hawkoff's chambers. Good to know. Uh he should be out tonight. Attending a hanging. I hate to do that, but I can't listen to it. That's enough. You never know what's copyright anymore. Display case key. To the display case that I already picked the... Lock to? Wasn't expecting that. Maybe we might have some evidence. And a desk key. Don't see a desk here. Do not forget. This is the key to the journal desk in the special room. Only take it if you're going down there. You lost it once. Good thing Welton found it. Good thing I got it back before he turned it into trouble. It could have led to some embarrassing questions. Made sure Welton got sick before he could say anything to trouble. No one reads that journal but me. What the fuck? Arkoff's ledger. Okay. Uh, Lord Mayor. Is this who he's paying off? Lord Mayor, Lord Innkeeper. Or is this just, just a regular ledger? Bishop Waller's zero G must attend to this problem. Or what they're paying him. Huh. Like protection money. The skirmishes to the north are escalating. The two factions appear to have endless supply of small arms. Trumbull intercepted four crates of weapons marked Bridgeport City Watch. Now we know where those arrows came from. I must find out who's supplying them and insert myself into the supply line. I smell gold, and I must have it. Lord Bascombe must be dealt with. He defies me, and it's hurting business. My clients are now increasingly reluctant to meet their payments. Bascombe needs to have an accident. Trumbull's become weak. So I spread the word... Wait, this isn't trouble? Oh, ooh, I wonder who this is. I spread the word that a bar of pure gold awaits the man who kills Bascombe. I hid the gold bar in Grimoire, Grimoire's vault. Legend says that that's where the church brothers hid their treasure. If only it was still there. I recall the night years ago when I found that vault. The buttons around Friar Felsen's sarcophagus held me at bay for the longest time. I thought I needed to push them in a certain... That was odd. What was that? I, like my entire comp computer just locked up. I apologize. In a certain sequence. I was elated when I found that the sequence didn't matter. Why has no one come forward to claim the gold? Is Boscombe's castle that formidable? Can't he be waylaid somewhere along the town road? I might need to get Trumbull involved, after all. Though I fear giving him the gold would cut his ties to me. Trumbull reports that someone is tearing pages from the church's history book in the nave. He says the map of the catacombs is missing, which tells me he's been reading the books. How is it that he was able to read the book before me? Found Grimoire's skull on its side, but still in its case. Someone's been trying to get at it again, but I have the only key. Uh, I picked the lock, by the way, so people can get to it. Despite my orders to stay clear of the chapel, it's clear that someone's been in there. Whoever it... Whoever it is doesn't know the skull is fake. Crap. I know, because I dropped it in Grimoire's sarcophagus in the vault and nothing happened. I've looked everywhere for the real skull. It must be in the catacombs somewhere, but it's too dangerous to search down there for very long. I am hoping there's a clue in the church's history, so it's important to recover all the missing pages. Great. Lady Isabella is up from town for a few days. I've had her put in the guest room, 
Supposedly, she's here to talk about her late husband's merchant business. But rumor is, she's looking for her fourth husband. I'm supposed to dine with her this evening, but I don't know if it's in my best interest to do so. This widow makes me nervous. I must find a reason to be away tonight. And he was, so she's around here somewhere. I'm assuming she's either a black widow, fourth husband, or uh, she's a strong woman and he can't take no strong woman. Yep. Anything up here? Mm, doesn't look like it. A bathroom. Ooh, and jewelry. So is someone forging the master's orders around the house and the master is dead, perhaps? I don't know. I'll take that. Is this said desk? Let me see something. No, it can't be because it opens. Holy water, you say? So when we go into the catacombs, there gonna be trouble. To do. One, have Cook stop serving those miserable eels for dinner. I'd rather eat old boot leather. Two, bring locksmith up from town to, br to repair broken locks on this desk and the wall safe. Lucky me. Three, make sure locksmith has an unfortunate accident on his way home. Four, Talk to Trumbull about his guards. He must be able to find reliable men somewhere. Oh, Trumbull's the... Trumbull's the master of the guard. The, the head of the guard. I'm Like I said, the, the names for some reason in my head are jumping back and forth. Five. Replace depleted candles on chapel sconce, which need the weights to lock it again. Done. Interesting. A chapel sconce, you say? Oh, actually, I can just do that. All right. Easy way out there. Don't know why I need that, but it is. All right. Before we go anywhere, can I jump up on... Thank you, piggy. Hello, wolf. How are you? These were perfect places to put some sort of secret, weren't they? Hmm. Do I have to poke at one of the eyes? Just... No? Okay. Fair enough. Thank you again, Piggy. Glad he's out for the night. Makes things much easier. Oh, goes straight to the church. Ah, Harkov's scroll. The servants and guards think the old builder hammer can bestow blessing on those who leave trinkets at its base. They even leave money. Treating the old statue as a wishing spot. I've told Trumbull this has to stop since some of his guards are thieves. I'm already certain one of them stole my fancy spyglass. I find out who. I'll beat him to death with it. Jesus Christ, dude. I mean, I'm a thief. Are you going to beat me to death with something? I honestly don't know what you would beat me to death with. Hmm. Hmm. Sorry, I'm looking up in the ra- Oh yeah, we need to get up in the rafters some other way. <laughs> nice landing. Too bad I didn't want you to. Is there anything on the dais? We also have to remember that the original church was not on this level. Don't know where that candle came from. It's very small. Hmm. Hmm. Odd. All right, let's try the next wing. 
wait, did I go over that way? Mm. I already came over here, right? Oh yeah, I didn't want to go up yet. Hmm. Odd. Where does this come out? Ah. And these? Yes, okay. So, I guess we're gonna have to go up to the... Attic. Hmm. It feels like I'm missing a whole wing on that level. Christ, how far up does this go? Wow, I can climb all the way up there. And there are people here. A feeling somebody's been living here. Wet catacombs. A map and inventory of the catacombs at Braden Church. Okay, so the guard did steal it. But where did he stash it? Why would he stash it in different places? That's strange, right? He just stash it there so he could read it at a later time. And he took the spyglass. I'm assuming this was a seeming. <laughs> I'm assuming this was all the same person. I'm not going to look around too hard just yet, but I'll have to remember that this stuff is here. Oh, wow. I'm actually going outside. Mm. Oh. You were saying? Mm, I don't think there's any harm leaving him out here. wonder if I can get up to the bell tower. Let's save before I fall to my death. Ah, that would be a no, I think. No. I just... Unless I bring boxes up here. Hmm. I clear this place out. I might very well do that. Ah, here we go. No, never mind. Uh, go further up this way, I guess. No, this is where... Oh, yeah, I can. Uh, I'm, I'm doubting myself so much right now. Seems like finding everything is only part of the problem. Or at least the, the puzzle. I guess, I guess a puzzle is a problem that you have to solve, right? I can't. There we go. Wouldn't let me lean. Hmm. All right, somebody stored something up here. Yep. Can't see it. Ah! It's literally right in front of me. I kind of feel guilty taking that because if the people that need it are still alive, I'd rather them have it. But that's just me. Hmm. Like I said, I think I'm missing the entire wing, and it might be because of those broken stairs. Which I can get to the second level of, but I can't I haven't seen the third level of them. That's probably my best bet, isn't it? Alright, let's see if there's anything here. A secret? No, it doesn't seem so. I already took their money from them, which was a horrible thing to do, but maybe you should wish for some better security? Something like that? Oh, hi. Never mind, I think I found the other wing. So, about that, I think I may leave it here, and we'll find out if the widow is a black widow next time. But anyways, hopefully you enjoyed my nonsense. If you did, like and comment, subscribing, 
and hitting that bell icon be I greatly appreciated. And this has been Boy Lag signing off. Oh god! Close the damn door, please! Oh god, it scared the crap out of me! Wasn't expecting that! Come in! I mean, don't come in! <laughs>